Hey guys, here's a quick redo video. Because again, my phone messed it all up. So we'll just start with this machine that I got today. It's a Dirt Devil Broom Vac, $8, as you might be able to see on the handle. Got this out when I was out in Cleveland. Just got popped the belt back on. It's a model, what was it now? 702. So it should work. If not, I do have a one in the basement that the casings messed up on so I basically bought it for parts if need be then here it's got a safety switch issue but there's a classic Omega 1CB and of course my flash didn't turn on like it was supposed to so you guys could actually see what we're looking at but whatever but yeah it's got a safety switch problem hang on okay yeah see how long we was sitting there just make sure I didn't have a phone number for the people on it before I went and showing you guys. Then, at a place called, what was this from Value World? Volunteers of America. I got this for 90 cents. Let's go to the wind tunnels. So that's brand new. Then, we got, not one, but two. Let me get this bitch out of the box. Brand new Eureka filters. These are like the World Vac and uh, Victory. I think they made one just like that. I'm not quite sure. Um, no receipt in there. Well, the receipt is still in that box, but that bag, but apparently not. Oh yeah, it is. But anyways, that was like three bucks and some odd cents. Then, just before I came home, I stopped at a Goodwill. Bought this accessory kit for my Craftsman uh, Power Mate shop vac. Well, shop vac, a uh, little hand vac that I got a while ago back. It was actually traded to Stars 1976 for a few years, and then I got it back. But I bought that thing years ago at Goodwill. Then, sadly, I know you can't see it that well. Bring it out here in the light a little bit better. I'll show you the rest later on. Actually, you know, let's just make this easier. Here we go, guys. It's the, uh, there's the bottom piece to it too for an Electrolux power nozzle. I mean, you can faintly see it in there. Uh, trunk's packed so full yeah, of stuff. It's kind of hard to get in there. Then, got this Dirt Devil Jaguar hood, or Featherlight. Sorry, Jaguar was another version of the Featherlight at one point. Then we got this Hoover power hose that I picked up. So, anyways guys, that's pretty much some of the last final, for, and I mean at this time, last final items you'll see from the vacuum shop. So, thanks for watching. You can't see over there, just faintly. You probably hear the flags rattling and the doors swinging on the building, in case you're wondering what those sounds are. But you probably weren't, so yeah, it's pointless. Info, but whatever.